Hi, my name is Jamal Roll, known as a celebrity artist. And I've been painting from I was four years old. I would always be the one in class that the teacher would ask to help to draw on the chalkboard. And while all of my other friends were drawing in 2D, I was trying to figure out how to make shapes and people in 3D, even though I didn't even know what it was. I just knew that I wanted my work to look real. And I used to draw on the walls and I used to get beaten for it and still did it. So that's how I knew that, you know, whatever this is, this art thing, this creative thing, that when I grew up, I was gonna be an artist. I'm known for my portraiture, because I've drawn portraits for a lot of well-known people from all around the world. Um, the big thing that distinguishes me is more than just my art, it's just me being creative as a person and adding business acumen to my craft and help it get to, to the next level. Um, a lot of people may think that if you're a good artist or singer or whatever it is you do, that's, that's enough. But no, you got to practice hard and find ways to, to get your craft out there. And that's what I did. I just um, find out ways to, to have my work exposed. And here I am painting for folks all over the world. I noticed that once I drew a celebrity and got it to them, another celebrity would see it and I would get some exposure where um, people were willing to, to get it because you know I'm the artist who did this celebrity. And so what I did is I started a, a marketing campaign where if a celebrity comes, I would just do the portrait. Sometimes three o'clock in the morning, they would be going to the club and you know, someone would tell me they saw this person or something and I would just work on that portrait and, and find a way to get it to them or get them to see it. And most of the time, or all the time, I would see that celebrity change from being people having and being a fan of theirs to them becoming a fan of mine. Rome was an interesting story because I just had an epiphany that said, I mean, just paint the Pope. I, I don't know, it was just, I was sleeping and this new Pope at the time was like in my head and I'm like, oh, why is this Pope in my head? I'm not even Catholic. <laughs> I'm like, why am I thinking about the Pope? And then I looked online and saw that he was Time Magazine person of the year that same time. And I'm like, well, I can't get rid of this Pope. And so I just embarked on creating the painting of him. Um, I got a letter from the Vatican who saw my portrait and they, they invited me to, to come to have an audience with Pope Francis. Um, that was a trip of a lifetime. One of the greatest lessons I've learned is a lot of people say, you know, you're so talented. How do you learn to draw? What school you went to? I got my talent from God. Uh -huh.